to off the board day five. I hope you guys are enjoying this series already. So today I am using that um, layout. It is a Studio Calico layout and I think it's made by Madame Rosenrot. I hope I'm saying that right. Um, but I loved the pom-pom trim and the florals and the colors. So I pulled out this pom-pom trim and I will cut it out, um, the pom-poms off the middle where my photo is going to go. The other thing I absolutely loved about this layout was the title. So I loved the long title. I do love the stitching of the title, but um, unfortunately I... <laughs> was not going to stitch the last word and you will see here shortly. So this picture is of my daughter from Valentine's Day and this was the candy she got at school. And she made a funny comment and that's where the title is going to come in. So you'll see that soon. So I'm just going to do some simple backing and there is my title you guys. So it says Valentine's Day, the beginning of diabetes. <laughs> I mean, she's a smart girl. She gets it like too much candy, um, but she has the biggest sweet tooth. So I can't actually say that she probably didn't eat all of that candy anyway, but um, it was funny. So I knew I had to use that as a title. And right after she said that, I was like, I have to take your picture because it's just such a funny story. So, um... I am taking these Maggie Holmes florals from Open Book and I am putting it in the basically the two areas that are in the layout as well. So just clustering it just like just like she did. It looks awesome. I did have to put a little bit of foam tape so that it would be even and I know for sure today I have two lovely ladies that are joining me. Um, maybe by the time this goes up, somebody else will be joining me. I'm not sure. But today I have Tisa and Christy from Christy's Beautiful Life. And they are using pins from their boards. And so I'm super excited to see um, what they picked. Um, it's just a I think it's a really fun series. I hope you guys are enjoying it as much as I am. Um, it makes me feel good about sitting in my bed and scrolling through Pinterest before I go to bed and pinning things because I know I'm pinning them and I'm going to use them. So um, that is kind of my rationale to that. <laughs> um, I do have a hashtag if you guys are playing along. I would absolutely love it um, if you would use it. So I've been trying to watch it and see who is playing along. Um, so the hashtag is OTBWPP, which is off the board with pineapple papers. And um, that way we can all see what you were doing. So I am going to add a cute little flare and an epoxy sticker that says love, as well as this tag from, I think it's Capture, it's an Echo Park, Capture Life um, sticker sheet. And this banner is from Jack and Jill. And I wanted to get the little girl on, but she didn't quite make it. Um, this sweet, I think, is a perfect, though, considering we're talking about candy. And then there is a one of those fabric tags that is up there as well. I guess it's more of a banner than a tag. So I'm pulling in just a sticker from the sticker sheet. And there are those cute little fabric banners. And I'm going to add this, a couple pieces of chipboard, because I do love me some chipboard. And I find that if I don't pull it out, I, I forget about it. So um, I am adding those hearts. And this is from one of the 
crepe paper Valentine's collections from back in the day. So I love how this turned out. Um, I hope you enjoyed this process video. I have a couple of close-ups for you. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comments below. Or if you just want to chat, I'd love to chat with you. So um, if you're not a subscriber, I would love to have you. And hit the like button if you like this series. So remember to wear your crown. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.